number one and number ten. And going early today because of the concerns about weather. Late. Kisner with his second shot to four. This is the preferred line. Also has eight iron. Frank, I'm about 10 feet from a bar, just in. And now Kisner playing quickly as always. Yeah, pitching wet. That's a nine iron. There it is! Here and, and let Kevin hit something now. Kevin, what was the hardest thing that you had to change? I know, I'm sure there was more than one thing that you had to change. What was the hardest thing for you to change? Uh, you know, we probably started with pivot. The way the, my hips worked in the golf swing, I always fought like kind of a reverse pivot. Got yeah. my spine tilted to the back. Towards the towards the right in the back swing, and um, I kind of that's how I grew up playing. Is that's how I hit it far. I got moved off the ball, trying to get as much arm swing as I could get. Okay. Uh, so when he came to me, he kind of showed me a, a blueprint of where he wanted to go, where I was then, and it's probably taken four years to get there. We still talk about pivot today on the range, so it's not like it happened overnight. It was a lot of hours of work and, and practice into it. And what was the drill? What was there? Uh, I'm sure there's a couple, but right. what was the one drill that really got, got Kevin going here? Go ahead and hit some shots for yeah, us, so Kevin. He, when, he, when he would start the club back, his hips would immediately start turning, running towards the hole, and his spine would tilt a bunch off of it. Yeah. And it's kind of this Mr. Potato Head thing. We had arms here, body there, eyes there. I know about these yeah. Mr. Potato Head things. <laughs> so he, he got over there and he was kind of stuck back there and the best thing he could do, only thing he could do was basically spin his, lock his leg out and throw his arms out, right? Just never could get the handle out of the ground. So he had a lot of pushes, a lot of heel hits, a lot of sweep yep. stuff. And that right shot, ultimately, that was the biggest thing he was fighting, so. A lot of times with this pivot drill, I try to feel like the club gets parallel to the ground before anything else moves. Before so, even the upper body moves, so you feel yeah, like you're just I, moving your arms. My tendency was always immediately to turn back and, and let those hips start falling towards yeah. the target. Gotcha. So I feel like if I can get it to there, and then I can load up better. So do you feel like you're you're almost sitting?